Hello, welcome back to the Caribou Data Science Channel. This is the third video in my ongoing series about uh, recapturing cursive writing from days gone by. My, uh, my objective is to actually do a better job of cursive writing than I, than I used back when I was in school. Okay, and of course what got me interested in, 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 uh, in cursive writing was that for some reason this some videos about this little book here about this little book here this is a Midori passport uh, notebook it's called a passport because it's the size of a passport okay and as you can see I've already started okay I've already started now, if you actually looked at that closely, you 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 would you'd only you could probably make out a few words, but you couldn't read the entire sentence and, and the notes and stuff. But the writing just isn't any good. Okay, of course, if you're going to do something like this, a nice leather cover, well, you you got to use a fountain pen. We might as well do it right uh, and learn learn to write with a fountain pen. Okay, this is a Kasaki. Uh, uh, that's not right. It's a Kahikawiki a sport pen. Very reasonable price, under twenty dollars. But it is a fountain pen. And if any as any serious writer, scribe, you know, cursive writing to fix you, I tell you, well, you you got to use a fountain pen. Okay. Now. That brings us up to date. Let's go back. Raise this little thing back up here. And look at what I received in the mail today. That's right, it's a letter from... It's a package from uh, Amazon. What could this be? What could this be? It is a book entitled The Practical Cursive Handwriting Workbook for Adults. 200 plus handwriting practice pages. 26 letters. 2,960 most common used words. 100 quotes from the world's famous leaders. Phil and intellectuals, philosophers and intellectuals. So let's just take a look and see what's, what's this actually what we're looking for. Okay. What I want you to notice down here is look at the A. Can you see the A? Do we have a table of contents? See what, see what the A looks like? The A looks like a capital A, looks like, a, like, like, a, like, a, like the, Ill, the, the little A, only bigger. B's fine. B's okay. C looks, C looks good, although, although it's missing a little flurries. You, you wonder if over, and the E's kind of curious, okay? F is interesting. Okay, like I said before, I don't remember that crossbar there. Okay, when I was when I was doing an E in high school, you, you, the look ball would come up, come all the way back across and down. Let F, little F, let's see, G's pretty much acceptable. L, or that's I, J, K, L, M looks normal. N, O, P. And Q. Now, I honestly don't remember what the, what the Q looked like, but I don't remember that. Okay. And I think what it is is R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, and Z. Okay. Gay is a word. The gay is a word we in here. <laughs> Great. You know what's interesting about this is. 
There's a whole bunch of words. Unfortunately, obviously this is designed to have you write over top, okay? And the words keep going. But what's interesting is, there's no actual sort of, first of all, <laughs> there's no table of contents. The other point is, as you can tell, the, the, the letter is, the letters here are pretty like, I think they want you to actually write over top of them. Respect has nothing to do with who is right and who is wrong. Okay? What's sort of curious is, Now, the thing that's kind of odd is two things. First of all, there is a, there's no index. Okay, so that's kind of curious. There's no index. Um, other exercise, you know, other things is uh, is that the, there's no actual sort of practice writing. I mean, you you, know, you you don't practice like a loops. You don't practice O's. Nothing like that. Because uh, as you can see, I saw, as you recall from yesterday, right? I came across these exercises the, the horizontal bar, then the cost bar, and finally we did a half page of the circles. Okay? There's none of those exercises in there. Okay? And this is another what I found. I found drawing the vertical lines more difficult than drawing the uh, horizontal lines because the vertical lines, they had trouble getting them touched the top and bottom bar. Okay. But anyway, so there's, there's our homework for the next, what, 200 days or something? <laughs> Go back and try to use this book to learn how to write, to improve our cursive writing. Okay. Well, thanks so much for your time, folks. Brief summer interview to kind of bring you up to date. Uh, We'll see you shortly with, with some more uh, cursive writing exercises, okay?